This is a review for the Dyson Gen 5 Outsize. The Gen 5 Outsize's airflow was measured at 53 CFM. Its suction was measured at 120 inches of water lift. These are both well above average results for a cordless vacuum. The Gen 5 Outsize is also able to maintain high suction over time because it uses multiple cyclones to filter out fine debris and drop it back down into its bin before it can reach and clog up its pre-motor filter. In our flower clog test, the Gen 5 Outsize picks up one cup of flour without issue, and almost no flour deposits on its filter. Compare this result to that of a vacuum that doesn't feature a multi-cyclonic design. The Shark Stratos picks up the same amount of debris just as easily, but a large quantity of the debris it picks up deposits on its pre-filter. The results of this test indicate that the Dyson will be much better able to maintain suction and require much less filter maintenance than the Shark. Cleaner head design is critical to the vacuum's performance in our debris pickup tests. The Gen 5 Outsize features the same cleaner head as the V15 and the Gen 5 Detect, just a larger version of it. The most important feature of this cleaner head is its front gates. The gates can be set to a closed, partially closed, or open position. In this first test, we set the gates to the middle or partially closed position to strike a balance between pickup of large debris and carpet deep cleaning. The cleaner head seals better to the floor the lower the gates. You can see how the vacuum has no trouble with fine debris, but pushes forward some large debris. In the second test, we set the gates to a fully open position to let through as much large debris as possible. In this test, the vacuum again has no trouble with fine debris, though it still pushes forward some large debris. In our hard floor stress test, the Gen 5 Outsize gets close to a perfect clean, even with the gates set back to the middle position. It also cleans well with its gates set to the fully open position. On carpet, large debris tends to ride up on the front of the cleaner head and get pushed forward. On hard floors, the cleaner head is able to ride over the debris better, which improves performance on hard floors. The Gen 5 Outsize also comes with Dyson's fluffy optic cleaner head. This cleaner head provides even better performance on hard floors. It illuminates what would otherwise be non-visible fine debris and has no trouble with large debris. With this cleaner head installed, the Gen 5 Outsize offers the best experience cleaning hard floors you can get with a cordless vacuum. Moving on to deep clean performance, the Gen 5 Outsize picked up 80% of debris after being pushed back and forth three times over an area of carpet embedded with fine debris in our carpet deep clean test. This ties it with several other cordless vacuums for having the best result in this test. Another component of our hard floor testing is our crevice test. And in this test, the Gen 5 Outsize again performed very well, easily pulling debris from the crevice even with its cleaner head gate set to a partially open position. Moving on to battery life and performance, the Gen 5 Outsize was tested to run for 12 minutes on high and up to 24 and a half minutes on medium power. Its carpet deep cleaning performance only drops down to 70% pickup on medium compared to 80% pickup on high. And it still picks up very well on hard floors on medium. So most users will want to use the vacuum on medium, a setting on which it gets a very good combination of battery life and performance. The Gen 5 Outsize also has a swappable battery, and it comes with an extra battery, which essentially doubles its runtime if you need it to run for longer than 24 and a half minutes. The Gen 5 Outsize features high quality seals and a HEPA postmotor filter, and so it easily passed our debris containment test. We didn't observe any fog leaking or exhausting out of the vacuum during this test. We do want to note here that most other Dysons also have a HEPA postmotor filter, but the Gen 5 Outsize has a larger, even more restrictive filter. Standard Dyson HEPA filters have been tested to remove 99.99% of particles as small as 0.3 microns. The Gen 5 filter has been tested to remove 99.99% of particles as small as 0.1 microns in diameter. The bottom line is that both filters are very good. Dysons with both types of filters pass our debris containment test, but the Gen 5 filter is the slightly better, more restrictive filter. In our long hair pickup tests, the Gen 5 outsize didn't tangle at all with 8 inch long hair and tangled with only a few strands of 14 inch long hair. Each result, especially the 14 inch result, is much better than average, meaning this vacuum is highly resistant to hair tangling. Moving on to ease of use, the Gen 5 Outsize is heavy for a cordless vacuum. Its main body is about a pound heavier than the Dyson V15 body, and about two pounds heavier than the Dyson V10 body. 
The main body of the Gen 5 outsize is also big, and so is its cleaner head. This makes this vacuum less easy to handle and maneuver around furniture than smaller, more compact Dysons we've tested. On the positive side of things, these design choices, the large size of the vacuum's main body and cleaner head, greatly increase the vacuum's cleaning efficiency. The main body is big because it holds a large dustbin. We measured it to have a maximum capacity of 1.5 liters. Most other cordless vacuums have a bin that's less than half as big. Because the outsized bin is large, it requires much less frequent emptying than a standard cordless vacuum dustbin. The Gen 5 outsize's large cleaner head is about 25% wider than the cleaner head of most other cordless vacuums. Because it's 25% wider, you can clean any particular space about 25% quicker than you can with a standard cordless vacuum. The Gen 5 outsize also has other quality of life features, like a back display that shows battery life remaining in minutes and seconds, and an on off button. You only have to press the button once to power the vacuum on and keep it powered on. Older Dysons, like the V10, use LEDs on their battery packs to show battery life remaining, and require you to keep their trigger pull to keep the vacuum powered on. The Gen 5 outsize also adds a particle meter that shows the size of the particles you're vacuuming though we didn't find this feature very useful during testing. A feature relatively unique to Gen 5 Dysons that we did find useful is their integrated crevice and brush tools. Instead of removing the vacuum's wand and manually installing one tool at a time, you only need to remove the Gen 5 Outsize's wand to start using this integrated tool. Summarizing all of the pros and cons for this vacuum, the Gen 5 Outsize offers very good airflow and suction for a cordless vacuum. It's also able to maintain high suction over time because its pre-motor filter doesn't clog easily with fine debris. This vacuum picks up most types of surface level debris very well with its standard cleaner head and provides exceptional performance on hard floors with its soft roller cleaner head. It also deep cleans floors very well. It was a top performer in our carpet deep clean test and in our hard floor crevice test. We also like that this vacuum is equipped with a very high quality post-motor filter and that it's highly resistant to tangling with longer hair. The biggest positives for the Gen 5 Outsize though are its large oversized dustbin and its extra wide cleaner head. Both of these features greatly increase cleaning efficiency with the Gen 5 Outsize. On the negative side of things, this vacuum may require more than a single pass to pick up large debris on carpet. It's also heavier and larger than most other cordless vacuums on the market. Moving on to general recommendations, the Gen 5 Outsize is the best cordless vacuum we've tested so far. Its biggest weak spot is pickup of large debris on carpet, but this is only really an issue if you have a lot of large debris to pick up, which is a relatively rare occurrence in the real world. Otherwise, you can simply line up its cleaner head gates to pick up isolated pieces of large debris on carpet. Another weak spot is its weight and size, but we feel the benefits of this design far outweigh the negatives. The benefits being, of course, you need to empty its bin much less frequently because of its large size, and can clean any particular space about 25% faster because of its cleaner head's large size. These two benefits are also the primary reasons why we recommend Dyson outsize vacuums over most other cordless vacuums we've tested. 25% better cleaning efficiency, being able to clean any space 25% faster cannot be overstated. It makes a huge difference in day-to-day -day use of the vacuum. Speaking of Dyson outsize vacuums, our review of the Gen 5 outsize wouldn't be complete without also comparing it to the standard outsize from Dyson. Compared to the standard outsize, the Gen 5 model has a slightly better post-motor filter, doesn't tangle as easily with especially long hair, adds an on-off button, a particle meter, and an integrated crevice and brush tool, and comes with a fluffy optic cleaner head and an extra battery. The standard outsize is an excellent cordless vacuum, even without these features and extras. It's currently recommended as the best mid-range cordless vacuum we've tested. The Gen 5 outsize, adding all of these features and extras, clearly makes it a better vacuum and a better overall cleaning package than the regular outsize, albeit at a higher price. If you're shopping for a mid-range cordless vacuum, we recommend the standard outsize. If you want to buy the absolute best cordless vacuum on the market, independent of price, we recommend the Gen 5 outsize. See the description of this video for links to buy these vacuums, as well as a link to the latest updated list of all of the cordless vacuums we recommend, and thank you for watching.